What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to your home for everything local sports. It's Paul and this girl soccer highlight video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company, the perfect place to cater your team's next event, and they've been doing it for over 30 years. Lakewood at Milliken, the crosstown rivalry, the backyard brawl. Doesn't matter what sport you're playing because these two teams do not like each other. Lakewood playing a little more defensive minded, like to take you out of your game a little bit. Rams like to connect passes, get into a rhythm. But from the opening kick, it was a midfield struggle, struggling, struggling. Both teams trying to push the ball up the field quick, but midfield play could not settle in. A lot of sloppy passes, a lot of watching the ball go back and forth. But there was a lot, and I mean a lot, of hard-nosed defense. What would a, Lake, a Lakewood Milliken blueprint backyard brawl be without a little pushing and shoving? A little extracurriculars after the whistle. When blue, gold, red, white are on the field together, tackles go in a little later, different colored cards start showing up, and reminders are sent like, hey, I'm just letting you know that I'm here. I'm, I'm letting you know that this thing ain't gonna be easy. In the 51st minute though, the Rams had a golden opportunity. Sophomore Harley Wade with a great first touch, finds herself at the top of the box. That's off the post. Wade playing more of an attacking position in this one. Unhappy with herself. Thought she should have had a goal right there. And about 10 minutes later, here's where things got a little interesting. Carly Slater, relation, wins the ball at midfield. Natalia Perez tugs Slater back by the hair. She sent off with a red. I mean, I don't have very long hair, but that can't feel good. Lancers are now down to 10 players. The Rams turned up the heat in the second half, but Lakewood keeper Marissa Gonzalez was having none of it. Maddie Engel with a great idea sending one inside the box here. That's scooped up by Gonzalez. And in the 73rd minute, great flick on there by Maddie Demo. Maddie Demo Tropalopalopolis. Harley Way, the heritage soft tail, finds herself in the box, tries to sneak one near post. But that's off the side of the net. She can't believe it, but the Lancers are still hanging tough. Set piece for the Rams. Wade swings one in. Stopped by Gonzalez. That's cleared away. Could the Lancers steal one late to play her down? Katie Obregon off the corner says, I'm going to do this myself. That's almost in, but that's off the crossbar. And then in the final minutes, the Rams have trouble clearing. Allison Casillas, she takes a rip. If she hits that, she's a hero, but that's over the crossbar. And that would do it in this one. We finished just how we started, nil-nil. Not the result the Rams were looking for, up a player, but the Lancers sure are gonna take it. A draw on the road in a tough more league schedule. That'll do it for them. Miller can host Compton on Thursday, Lakewood travels to Downey. Thanks to all of our sponsors, including Papa Lucci's, a great place to eat on 2nd Street. Stay with us, more league soccer fans. This is going to be a tight more league girls soccer race. Probably one of the closest that we've seen in recent years. And you know where to be. You know where to catch all your action. It's gazettesports.com and the Press-Telegram.